Well, I just watched Zootopia. Well, never thought a simple Disney movie. Actually, scratch that. Actually, a Disney movie can bring up good things to uh, talk about. Yeah, this is going to be for Tuesday, so I'm trying to pack it in for my day. So, Zootopia. Let's talk about it. Now, warning, spoilers may be ahead. And deleted scenes, because some of the deleted scenes were really good and I'd like to reference that. So, if you haven't seen Zootopia, go watch it. I can wait. I mean, I'm here on YouTube. Yeah, I mean, you can click my video anytime. Now, if you haven't seen the movie and you don't care about the spoilers, alright, let's get it to it. Well, Zootopia. Well, you know, this is a movie talking about equality and how some lesser races want to be more powerful than the other races. So let's talk about it, since I'm going to piss off Black Lives Matter, feminism, sovereign citizens, I'm going to talk about that. And it's going to be a part of my video, I'm offended, good. That might be Wednesday or Thursday, I don't know. But some of this points will be a part of that video as well, so don't get your hopes up, because Expansion pack for World of Warcraft is my first priority. I'm sorry. But again, so Zootopia Miss Hops. Which I'm going to say this in the basic term. Well, not basic terms. I'm not trying to make you all sound stupid, but I am talking about feminism, so it's good enough. Um, let's see. Miss Hops' dreams was to become a police officer. And yes, she's a bunny. And she's the only first cop. And the world beat her down. Instead of hopping down, she hopped up. Which, good, good job, Disney. I love you. So, it was genius of this writer making a fox who was cunning. And he was different. He was white. Well, it's like, he was a fox. And predators were seen as predatory. And so, again, they were different people, different ideas, different facts. Ground. And she still achieved it with the help with her friend, the fox. I've, and she didn't allow that to cripple her fate. Now and then she had like things that crushed her. Her family somewhat didn't believe her in somewhat. And she was crushed, but she kept going. She didn't blame the world. She didn't fucking insult it and say, I'm giving up. And she rised above and she became what she became. She cared for justice and made sure that everyone's equal. equal. Now let's talk about why I think feminists, black lives, and sovereign citizens are doing the opposite of making everything equal. So, before I become called a racist, a sexist, I don't know how in bloody hell I'm sexist. I'm a fucking female, dumbass. And a sovereign sit, uh, a brainwashed drone or something. Let's talk about it. Black lives, what do you want? Equality, right? But when someone brings up different points of views or articles or anything that back up the claims, you shut them down. You shut them down before they even have the time to speak. If they say anything, Actually, truthful, shut down. If anyone gives different opinions, this goes through sovereign citizens and feminism. Feminist. They shut you down with names. They don't allow you to speak. If they wanted equality, they would allow you to speak your opinion. They would allow you to tweet. They wouldn't go to a fucking nation and try to or pretend they're a fucking victim. And there are going to be people who are going to use their disability, autism, Down syndrome, whatever ability, disability you fucking have. I have fucking autism, and I don't use it as a crutch. It's not a crutch. Yeah, it's going to be hard for me to stay still in a chair long enough. Yeah, I'm going to have difficulties pronouncing words. But again, I don't allow that to define me. I don't allow this to define me. And I don't know why you people fucking use your race, gender, or what sexual orientation? Look, people. If you want to be a police officer, a doctor, of 
a lawyer. You're black, white, gender, whatever gender you are. You can fucking do it. You have equality. You just want to be treated like a princess or a king. And I'm sorry, that's not how the world fucking works. If you don't like it, get the fuck out. Because I'm sorry, princess, that's not how the world works. Your father might give you whatever you fucking want, but it doesn't change the fact that the world doesn't need to kneel down to you. The media might be kneeling down for you, but not me. And not people who think your ideology is stupid or your fucking opinions. And again, who fucking cares? And then I'm going to end it with this. Oh, actually, I'm not going to end it. I have more, a couple more statements, and then bam, I'll be done. So, again, Zootopia is for equality. Not to be treated as superior. Because in the end, the villain who was the mayor's assistant, she wasn't treated equally. But she allowed her hatred to consume her. And she wanted to become more superior. And with that, she wanted to remove predators. What makes you any different? If you're going to go out there in the Black Black Lives Matter and beat up some white guy because he disagrees with you, or feminist, what makes you so fucking different if you silence a male guy because you don't like what he has to say? Or sovereign citizen, what makes you any different than the police officers you hate? It doesn't. And you allow that hatred of yours to go off and you will attack, you will silence, you will do everything in your fucking power because you know, deep down, you fucking know that you're wrong on this situation. You want to be treated like the king? Well, I'm sorry, Sally. This is not how the fucking works. If you don't like it, get the fuck out. There's a cave, live there. Because this bullshit ain't gonna fly. And I bet if the females from the past who are feminists would come to our present day, they would love this. Being treated equally. Somewhat. Being treated like a human. If Martin Luther King Jr. came here today in the present and saw that men, that, black, that blacks have rights to vote, Go to restaurants without being segregated? He would love that. Don't get me wrong. There aren't going to be cops that aren't going to be racist. But fuck. Doesn't define them all. And all you're doing, feminists, sovereign citizens, and Black Lives Matter, you're generalizing. You're being an idiot. You're being sexist and you're being racist. You're being what you hate. And it is sad. So, like, subscribe, all that beautiful jazz. I hope you enjoyed the video. And let's take this with, go watch Zootopia. I'm definitely buying this movie because it's an awesome, awesome movie. Great job, Chris. You truly know how to talk about stuff. I bet a lot of people are going to be pissed off. But freedom of speech is more important. Bye-bye.